Bonjour! You might be wondering where I am. Take a look around. What does it look like? I'm at the pa 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 Cemetery. Um, it's where a lot of the important uh, figures, not just French, have been buried. Um, there are tombs of many, many people around here. And I'm about to go find one. Um, so back in the 1800s, uh, cemeteries were banned in Paris because there was one that was really close to the markets, Les Halles, and it was a health hazard. So they banned them. And this one was the first one of the first ones. Or uh, it got moved to the you know edge of the city. Uh, we're in the eastern edge of Paris right now. And I think I go this way. I hope I'm right. There's a lot of tombs. It's amazing how they're all still here. I think I go this way, but there's a tour group there now. There wasn't before. Um, if I'm right, this is where um, Frederick Chopin's body is. He's Polish, but he was buried here. Um, he is my favorite romantic composer. I really love all of his pieces, and I'm just going to go show you right now. Un incinéré, normalement, on l'a vu tout à l'heure, c'est un funérarium, un jardin du souvenir. Mais Pierre Desprogetans, c'est un personnage qui commence à être connu, qui était connu et reconnu. Euh, donc la ville de Paris va faire une dérogation et on va déposer ici les cendres en surface. En surface, parce qu'en dessous repose un soldat de 1914, un poignet de la marque. As you can see, people bring fresh flowers and water from every day in memory of him the greatest romantic composer ever. Um, yeah, the cemetery is huge. It's got, I don't even know, like, I, the only ones I marked down to visit were um, Chopin, George Bizet, an opera writer, Molière, a playwright, um, Oscar Wilde, a writer, and Jim Morrison, famous American singer who died. Okay. I guess I'll end for now. Pretty creepy at some parts, just wandering around the cemetery by myself.